Hello, people of New Zealand, the Philippines, and Taiwan. Hello, people of the earth. I am Michael Especially Davies. people here. This is Roger Bennett. One of us is in a slightly better mood than the other one today. Everton fan, Chelsea fan. Oh, oh. This is a bizarro episode of Men yeah. and Blazers New Zealand. Happens very rarely. In the... Oh, I am happy. Yeah. So fleetingly, I've so never briefly. Seen it. Dave is. He's been sobbing. Yeah, well, I haven't been sobbing. Although, like uh, Jason Day. Oh, Jason Day, he sobbed. What a winner. Uh, I know New Zealanders, not quite sure how you feel about an Australian winner on the PGA Tour. But we know how you feel about Chelsea being defenestrated. Yeah. Fair bottom spanking that no one saw coming. Yeah, Manchester City 3, Chelsea nil. Before the game, Rog, all the talk was about the Chelsea doctor, physio, Eva. Carneros and John Fern crisis with manager Jose Mourinho, Dr. Eva, John Fern. They've been resigned to the bench. Rog reassigned uh, over there. And uh, it's been everything that Chelsea have and been doing this target, week. Just to answer the questions. And I'll for Jose Mourinho yeah. taking on such an iconic beloved figure. As they say on the wire, kind of, when yeah. you come at the Queen, you best not miss. Yeah. Jose Mourinho, this is one of the first times in his second coming at Chelsea yeah. where it kind of looks like he's missed. Yeah. So the 2-2 two two draw more popular than him. against no Swansea it. in week one. This is a massive game, Dave, with huge repercussions. Yeah. And it started so badly within 25 seconds. Yeah. I and mean, it's for the second time this season, if you count the community shield as the season, Chelsea caught flat-footed right from the opening whistle, Rog. Uh, just 25 seconds in, David Silva... Gets the ball on the left, puts through a ball to Kunaguero, and he does what he does all <sighs> afternoon, Rod. Breaks through the center of Chelsea's defense. Only Begovic, frankly. Chelsea could have lost this game 7 0 without Begovic, Yeah, Rog. I mean, the first part of this game just seemed to be a game of one on one between Begovic and Kunaguero, who had several chances. Yeah. Begovic didn't expect to play too much at Chelsea, but razor sharp in this game, kept them in the game single handedly until Kunaguero broke through. It was David Silva with a ball in, yeah. a give and go. Five Chelsea defenders and swarmed smalls. upon Kunaguero, but he still fancied his chances. He just rolled the ball past Begovic. John Terry splayed on the floor. It, oh. it strictly Gave should have counted no for two Gave goals. Gave you no pleasure. And that was it. 1-0, David. Yeah. Uh, Chelsea tried to get back into the game. Man City. Taking John Terry off the field. Yeah, well, Man City continued to have chances, Rog, right up until the interval. At the interval, Rog, John Terry substituted by Jose Mourinho for the first time in the history of those two players in a manager-player relationship at Chelsea, Rod. Yeah, he began the second half, sat on the base bench with a face on him. Oh, yeah. Gave me no pleasure whatsoever, but yeah, it didn't help. Chelsea still liable at the back. Kun Aguero still hurting them. And the shocking thing about the second goal was not that it came, yeah. but that it came off a set piece. Against yeah. Chelsea, we know them as the organised, disciplined, defensive yeah. unit, Dave. Oh, here they were anything but. Yeah, very true. We should say before that, Ramirez had a goal disallowed for offside. Oh, he celebrated fantastic. way too early, uh, which Turned you enjoyed to the, too. The Chelsea, but make some noise! Everybody knew it was offside, apart from him. Eden Hazard had a great chance to score. There's something wrong with the little Belgian, Rog. Not playing, uh, not in the form that I think Chelsea fans expect him to be this season. And then Falcao comes on in the 79th minute. Ready to change the game for Chelsea. Yes. Unfortunately, it changed the game for Manchester City from the ensuing corner. David Silva swings it in. And as you said, set piece defending. Ivanovic abused Rog. Abused by Van Son Company. By he Van has Son risen. Company. Let's back. win it He's for back. Eva. He shouted at the Manchester City <laughs> faithful. And within minutes, it was 3-0. Yeah. Fernandinho yeah. with a master blaster. Who would have saved it? Well... Courtois would have saved it. Rog. No, only Sergio Romero would have saved that one, <laughs> Davo. And yeah. it ended 3 0. Shocking. It was almost yeah. Game of Thrones shocking. No one saw it coming. But don't worry, Chelsea fans. Jose Mourinho explained it away. It was a fake result, Rog. It was a fake result. Yeah. It, it never may happened. not have actually happened. It was all the dream. It was a myth. <laughs> it was just completely I fabricated. I think we may hear that from Jose Mourinho. It's going to be a tough week for Chelsea fans. Buckle up. It's yeah. going to be interesting to see what happens next over there at Stamford Bridge. Yeah. Made even worse the week by the fact not just Chelsea lost, but for Chelsea fans, POV, oh. Arsenal won against a gritty, uh. gutsy Crystal Palace. Yes. Great game of football, Rog. But Arsenal go down to Selhurst Park, come out with a 2-1 victory. Opening goal, Rog, for Arsenal was scored by Olivier Giroud. With a bicycle kick, Rog. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Don't know what was more gorgeous, said Olivier Giroud. My goal or my face? Yes. Who knows? But Arsenal fans exult. 
We're out of the relegation zone. We're yeah. out. And Arsenal managed to plug this one out. A fine win against, I think, a fine Crystal Palace team who will hurt a lot of others in this new world order where the middle yeah. teams, the Stokes, the Crystal Palaces, the Swansea's yeah. are going to take points off some pretty big teams this season. Yeah. Talking about some kind of mediocre teams that will take points off some big teams this season, Manchester United. Yeah, Manchester United, Rog. They go to Aston Villa. Rog, a team that won in week one. Man United managed to scrape out another result. Surprise before the game. Adnan Yanazai, Roger Play, has been out of favour uh, under Louis van Gaal. He gets the start and it's his goal, Rog, uh, that ends up winning the game. Yeah, a deflected shot again. Some wonderful work. He sat Micah Richards down onto his buttocks before yeah. firing it past Brad Guzan with the aid yeah. of a deflection. And Manchester United, six points, but a six points with many question marks. It's more like six points yeah. rather than six points. It's very true. Uh, another very bad call in this game, Rog. Michael Richards uh, on the rough end of a Darmian hold uh, in the penalty area uh, from a set piece, Rog. Uh, doesn't get the penalty. One for another fans. bad, another very bad call today, Benteke. Uh, a clearly offside goal, Rog, against Bournemouth. Who had Bournemouth one notched out exactly also had a goal ball. disallowed. Oh, the cherries. Yeah. Some big wins. Swansea. Yeah. Again, impressing Davo. West Ham and Winston Reid, not so much. Reese yeah. Oxford looks like a 16 year old again. Yeah. Well, it's okay. You can play for the under 18s. Performance uh, of the week, possibly. Everton 3, Southampton 0. Oh, I was going to say Leicester. I was, in, I was braced for a weekend yeah. of darkness. They had yeah. the early kickoff. Yeah. Somehow, unbelievably, change of tactics, change of performance, change of approach, change of everything. Change, change of, of shirts. shirts, Roger. I was going to say the brown shirts. I thought they were like, kind of crappy green. They yeah. thought they were the worst garments I've ever seen until 22 minutes into the game when Romelu Lukaku rose up, yeah. headed the ball home. They're the most beautiful sacramental garments I've ever seen in my life, David. Yeah. Leicester City, still surprising. They don't need Nigel Pearson. He was holding in the back. Oh, we've got Claudio Ranieri. Rod, the Tinker Man is back. <sighs> and he's top of the league right now. Equal top of the league, Rog. Well, look, we're still only 2.38 of the way through the season. That is only 1.19. There's a long way to go. City look better than everyone so far. I think we have to say that. And we've got some big teams, Chelsea, Tottenham, in a little bit of trouble very near the foot of the league, Rog. Liverpool Arsenal awaits next weekend. Oh, David, Monday night's one. game. We will be back to break it down in all of its delicate intricacies. Yes, and glory, glory, glory. Courage.